Hello, party people. Happy Friday. It's time to get back into some Horizon Zero Dawn. I already see a couple of you in the chat. Squad player, squad player. Uh, I'm actually off today, so nice. I feel nice and relaxed. I feel like I'm going to do great today, you know, the usual. Um, and we're talking about laundry. Great start to a stream. <laughs> Anyways, guys, today I'm going to be focusing on the main quest for this game, and we're going to see how far we can get. Um, fun story. Okay, let's start off with some tea, you know? I, I, I don't know how many of you guys were here when I told you about the, someone stealing a tree at work last week. The suspect has struck again. Literally, my, my co-worker came to work 4.30 in the morning. Early as fuck, right? And a tree is gone again from the pod. Dirt everywhere. But the tree is, like, laying on a bunch of our chairs so the the suspect took the tree and ran into our chairs and left it and ran away so so he's back guys and definitely this tree was right in front of a freaking camera as a goddamn idiot and we file a police report i just i just can't even freaking believe why would you steal not one but two two trees <laughs> i gotta show you guys the picture of the tree just laying i don't know if you can see it that well but uh, 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 ring light. Here's a tree just laying on our, our chairs, and there's just dirt everywhere. So you must be live pretty close by, because if you're gonna try and run away with a tree down the sidewalk again, you must be living. You must be a neighbor, right? Because it's a pretty big tree. <laughs> hey, what's up, Ralph? Ralph, Marcus, Jack, Teddy, welcome to the chat. I also saw so long. Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, it's so fucking weird. I just can't believe people. People are so goddamn crazy in the world. Uh, <laughs> this is why we're here. Like, barely going outside. We're just at home or at work. <laughs> people are crazy. Oh, sorry to hear that, Marcus. Sorry for your loss. Funerals are... The... Um, I don't know how many of you are here for my announcement, uh, last stream, but I changed the, uh, goal for my Vi Queen throne because I found another chair I really want, and it's a bit more reasonably priced. I don't want to, like, go hard to get, like, a, like, the best kind of gaming chair yet, just because, you know, I'm thinking of going back to school. We'll see how much streaming I get done when I'm trying to get masters, we'll see. Um, but, uh, I found a really cool chair online that's just for 300, so that's why I lowered it from 500 to 300. And the chair is called Zenus Gaming Chair. It's even got a massage, massage, back massager, got two pillows, one for the back, one for the neck. So that's like, I think, a more reasonable goal for my Vi Queen throne. And then I changed the value of what I've received because YouTube takes 30%. So I think it was 280 something before. Now it's 212 because it took a 30% cut. So this is more accurate of what our goal is. So, you know, any donations, right? welcome and as soon as i hit that goal i'm gonna literally place the order for pretty awesome gaming chair and i'll have a full great setup because i have a desk now i got my ring light i got my camera i got my mic everything's good um whew. so let's get back to this game guys i'm getting so many subscribers as well it's pretty freaking awesome get like a couple a day okay so we're going to Meridian. But this one's closer, so let's do that. Oh, I don't know how to go to map again. Oh, really far away. Coolio. Let's just go here, I guess. <laughs> Good one, Teddy. Cremation tomorrow. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear about that, Teddy. Um, my sympathies are with you. I, I get tripped out whenever there's not a... Um, Many maps to know where I'm going. The hell? Uh, 
Wait, okay, we got alligators and we got whatever this fucking bag is. Sure. Later today I'll be playing some GTA if you guys want to stick around for that. I had a really fun run of uh, Red Dead yesterday. And I did really well in Warzone 2, got 2nd and 4th place. charge I mean destruction of property yeah but he did steal one creep before so that's a theft charge probably um I just decided to put um some Stella beer in here it's just like until I get oh by the way I ordered um a holder for my horn so you can like sit nicely right now it's in like my mug and it's just like whenever I put it down it swings around and it spills beer I should be getting the uh, holder next week. And then um, I'll be using that again for beer. But yeah, it's a pretty full cool holder and I got like a deal on it too. Peasants, bro, it's so, it's an import beer. It's pretty expensive here. Just keep running, guys. Keep quiet now. What's that? What the hell? Where's that? I think I'm in the clear. Weird. I actually saw a Viking helmet beer hat and like, I don't know if it was a movie or a show or something. And I was like, dude, I need that so bad. <laughs> it looks so cool. And we had a little action on the way there. Maker's End. Not much farther now. Bolton said he found an image of the woman I resemble on an ancient device. If she's my mother, why would there be traces of her all the way out here? So far from the world. I don't get it. Maybe she... The name is a little civic. You spying through my focus again. This thing has like um. Well, go on. What do you know about it? 
steal your present course before long. You will know where his boat is at, Dave. Maybe you better. Did he even come down here? I don't think so. But be wary. Make a zap as a crawl in the clips. I can see many of them. Let's get down. A blimp seems from a group just outside the boards. You focus with your location. Yeah, that's the goal, right, guys? <laughs> that's what Teddy said. Ooh, can I ride these horses over here? That looks like a ram. That's it. Nothing to see here. I just think it'll work. Right. Optional one. Oops. Oops. Wait, what the fuck? Where am I? Uh, can I on your camp? Is it that one? Yeah. Whoa! I like ran right into this man, I'm so stupid. Whoa. That was crazy. That was a headshot. Take that, little asshole. Bam, bam. Aw, oh, shit. Bam. Is that names or something? Oh, there's a guy up there. Fuck him up. Damn. Go. Do the headshot. Bitch. Oh, we don't have health. <sighs> it's been legal for a long time, but I, I don't do drugs, guys. Nope, nope, nope. I just don't like how... You know, I like being in control. I'm, a, I'm one of those people that just like being in control all the time. Oh shit. No healthies, okay. No traps. Oh yeah.
fuck. Whoa, I did not expect that. Shit. What the hell happened? I mean, I'm done, so I, I mean, I just know I don't like it. Uh, oh. There go. Who is he and how does he know these things? He said Elizabeth Sobeck. What kind of name is that? Far away is that? Can't see shit, man. Looks like I'm clear. You're right by me, you fucking asshole. Oh, you fucking lucky asshole. Try and some of these guys have healies. Kidding me, dude? They just come out of nowhere. Whew. Okay, let's do this better. Let's stop being idiotic. He? How does he know these things? He said Elizabeth Let's have a clear How shot. Do Don't do it. They just keep, keep coming from behind me. I didn't like that. Didn't like that one bit.
Why would you get into fights, buddy? so stupid they can't leave the walls really how is that not a headshot headshot again this is a fucking joke Is gonna go look for him, come to me again. Do the one shot losing patience quickly. They're like almost too far away to fucking win because they're such an idiot. I feel like I don't play this game like it's supposed to be <laughs> played. I'm not stealth, but I'm also like, I hide behind boulders where they can't get me. Or I'm just like, they can't get past as well because it's the only way to get to me. But you just gotta be patient, you know, and wait for them to come to you. I already forgot I was here. I'm oh, serious, you man. It's not over till it's over. No. He's messing those porn arrows, man. Fucking make it. Make it hurt. Wait, 
Wait, did I miss him again? I believe I'm missing him. It's ridiculous. Got any health potions? Ooh, I see something I want. We'll get him. Glitching out so hard. Jesus. <laughs> Yo, Teddy, we are ruthless, man. Hey, what's up, James? Welcome to the chat. Yeah, I would look good in some cool war paint. Save that right away. Street seems full of smiles. Where's all my loot? Tell 
Buddy, that's not happening. We have to trust in our king to appease the sun and what's our main question again? Ah. Corruption from the land. My driving is so bad. <laughs> Lisa's um, horse is better than the one I read it, which I killed three times yesterday accidentally. Good job.
not escape the shadow. Nice roly poly. But not hit enough. I'm trying now. You guys happy? Am I too close to the blast radius? You got anything better to do? Yeah, speak louder, lady. Jeez Louise. Yeah, he's a moderator. He's the most generous and dedicated watcher I have. So on oh, advice and you know. They're giving up. I won't give up on us, even when the hands get rough. There is no prowler here, sir. Prowler, no, does not exist. Oops. Bam. Quietly. We gotta be sneaky. Come into my view. I dare you. It's good. Kill them, but it kills the dinosaurs. That makes complete sense.
These dig sites, they're massive. You guys are hilarious. Yeah, definitely got a weirdo yesterday. How did that hurt me so much? Ah, oh, dude, I tried to roll, but I couldn't drink and roll at the same time. Man, this girl wasn't as talented as I am, I guess. That was a mistake. Yeah, he's comic. Teddy the Viking Queen Slayer. What do you want to do here? How does that not kill someone? Twenty-two guys, my lucky number. Fucking duck right. You're so lucky. Whoa, why did I put it up there? A corruptor. That might prove a challenge. Dude, these these guys do fucking ninja rolls too. Ah! 
Whoa, how did that hit me when I was behind a plane? I don't like this area at all, dude. What the fuck? How did that not hit him? Man, they really flame, play, play, play around when they're uh, burned. electric thing and just walk right by it. Oh. Can't be stealth for the life of me, can I? Right through the church. 
Like, that's such bullshit that I can do that. It's honestly such garbage. My horse is still here. Once this pen blow its vulnerable bits off, I just don't have any of these good arrows. But I'll try. I need to do them when it's away from the people. They're just annoying. Yeah, I'm gonna try one more fucking time. Jesus Christ. Wait. I like those bomb things, though. Those are fun.
Fighting at our side, Meridian will be ours once more. Go into my dragon. Go guys. Nailed it.
here somewhere. All right, I'm gonna go. Oh, I didn't see that there. Hello. An explosion. Oh, really? Oh, skill points. Heck yeah. Okay. Let's save them up. That is going on. be the hard part. Oh, I don't have any healies. All weapons operation. Uh -oh. Time to get it moving and be quick about it. No oh, great. <laughs> Oh, he's just he didn't even get him. Focus. It stopped working. I disabled his focus. Wait, what? You didn't something. catch on fire? I'll handle it. That's not realistic, bro. Still sniffing around. I just really pull her here until they calm down.
Give up, everybody. Do it. Or come for me. Finally. Again, yeah, not the way you're supposed to be playing this, but <laughs> yeah, I like to look for easy ways that aren't too boring. How do I do this? I pretty much nailed this, guys. I didn't even die once, I think. Using my...
say what you have to say. What? What is this? The entity lives. Unacceptable. 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 Uh. Okay. The heck? Oh. Well, it can blow you up. Uh, I don't want to have that. What the hell was that? Hades? Hey! M mysterious stranger, did you see that? No answer, huh? Figures. Things just keep getting stranger. I need to find a way inside the tower. Looks tight, but I can squeeze through. I don't want to have that thing in my ear if it's going to blow oh, my brain out. Oh, I tend to scan. It was 99 something percent? Like, that means that it's a clone, at least. Or unless it's like, oh, just has the same similar kind of DNA as a daughter, but I don't know. Like. Trees are thick. Hard to line up a shot. You are 355,510 days out of date for your meeting with Mr. Fair. Please proceed to the 35th floor. Wait, wait, wait. 350,000. That's hundreds of years ago. What's going on? Born and I, a machine built to kill, and they honored it. Welcome to Feral Automated Solutions, kill, where all the problems of tomorrow are. What was this place? What were they doing here? It was a corporation, a group of people not unlike a tribe, and they made machines. Yeah, go on. I've uploaded some data files to your focus, they'll help you understand. Military and defense contract. Wait, sixty-three. This is interesting. Why can't I interact with this thing? Oh, there. Now, I know this must seem like a bizarre change in direction. I mean, we're Faro Automated Solutions, right? Number one robotics firm in the world. 
Why would we clear our production slate to fabricate human-operated vehicles and weapon systems, the relics of the past? All I can say at this juncture is... We will be exploiting a massive, uh, growth opportunity by retooling and reallocating capacity according to my plan. So I will need revised projections of mass fabrication velocity across every pipeline within 36 hours. So they were making machines, then they stopped to make other kinds of weapons? Okay, Teddy. Why? Yes, not. You weirdo. That is a ramp to get back up. Ramp, yep. Here now. Oh, there's a ladder. I was like, I'm looking for a ladder. Looks like we can climb here. Really get it part four and find it, so <sighs> made it. it. Looks like the way up. What's left of it. So so set, Daddy. Over her hand. If plants can find a way to hang on up here, I guess I can too. began when they engaged in unauthorized offensive operations against robots and human personnel of the Hearts Timor Energy Combine. Now I wish that I could relate that the crisis has been exaggerated, but it's not. The peacekeepers have not responded to stand down coats, and by all signs they appear to be replicating at a precipitous rate. Now what I can promise you can absolutely assure you is that I am already devoting every possible resource towards reaching a speedy conclusion to this issue. When you hear the bad talk about us against this company in the days, maybe weeks to come, just bear in mind that we will get past this. And the day's coming when none of this will matter. Peacekeepers. That's what they called their machines. They were built for war, not peace. 
really interesting stuff. Wait, didn't we just get here? Oh! <gasps> what the fuck, dude? I hit X. Well, oh, <sighs> she's dead. God damn it, bro. I sh needs to get even better at climbing. Maybe it was slippery. Who knows? <sighs> that scared me a little bit. Just a little bit, though. <laughs> I'm trying to get to the top right, so I think this is, I'm not following the arrows for this one. Okay, don't fall again. All right, made it. Wonder what we'll find. <sighs> All data has been erased from this device. Do you wish to deploy other privileges to recover purged data? Oh yes, I believe I do. Elizabeth, good to, uh, it's been years. <laughs> Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your data confirms this. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. He's not interested, You screwed bro. something up to something big or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. So spit it out. There's a glitch in the chariot line. You're a killer robots? Peacekeepers, yes. Those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would, if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's worse than that. <sighs> Show me the data then. And I'll take that lunch. Alone. Ted Faro brought Elizabeth Sobek here, <laughs> but they hated each other. He's desperate, I guess. Another thing has been recovered. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. Fully aware. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. That's how the world that ended to this fucking Ted guy. Man, he said he left because of he, he's to blame. He's to blame. Limited self-manufacture <laughs> controlled. Not anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. What? You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. Jesus. We're not talking the fall of civilization, we're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained, it can't be! You know what I mean? Right. Before the truth kicks out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. Faro robots threatened all life on Earth, but 
Somehow she defeated them. The world of the old ones fell, but life went on, or, or we wouldn't be here. That's cool. The final battle has been Project Zero Dawn. Jesus, listen. There has to be another way. That's the name of the game. Or miss, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim, but it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got a choice, Ted. You I fucked know. up, Ted. Now own I'm it. I'm speaking to you from a VTOL en route to US Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? what? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Right. <laughs> Jesus, Liz. You don't have to yeah, she me. does, because you're not cooperating, bro. I'll sign. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. God forgive me. <laughs> what made her solution so terrible? Yeah, it's not a What did she do to stop the robots? Executive access detected. Expert. This, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching, and I'm still no closer. Yo, she cloned That's herself. Your to everything you just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? You've stopped listening you really Try talking that way to me face to face. Yeah. As you wish. Do you really have no idea how monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So. You have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that feral robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name yep silence that's my name now oh i thought you said silence question, but it's silence something less trivial <sighs> all right silence you've made your point i came to these ruins hoping to learn more about this elizabeth sobeck and i have but I still don't understand my connection to her, or why the Eclipse is trying to kill me, or who Hades is. No answers, just one question after another. Exactly. Which is why it's time to expand your frame of inquiry. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection oh, that's yet. Reddit? Oh the only my way God. to find out is to keep Rest going, peace, to keep man. making discoveries. Great voice actor Thanks to you, games, we've only games, just now right? learned that feral robots once threatened to end life on Earth. He was in... But it didn't happen. Lost The well? old one's civilization was destroyed, but life... Life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots and before all was American lost? Horror Story. What was Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Of course I am. 
Then why are you still standing here? Why is he listening into our conversation? I know he wants to learn too, but like, I don't, it's a bit creepy. <laughs> but yeah. You're insufferable, you know that? Let's get on with this. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists as a ruin. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Cherry name. You'll find it in the Eastern Mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil, or a BOR-7 Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. I'll contact you when you get there. I can't wait. Someday we'll meet in nice. person, and your manners had better be improved. Cool, we got the three skill points. Let's see what we can get with it. Yes. Skip. I what? What? You said we were done with a conversation. I could ask more questions, but I don't feel a need. I was just listening to him. Well, we're gonna done, go and get up. answers now, like he said. Wait, I can't fast travel. Faster than getting up here, at least. U.S. robot oh, okay. Next. Yeah, elevator. Gotcha. To learn the secrets of Zero Dawn. Will the snow cover? This so slide. No. Let's do some of this other quest, the Meridian one, and then we'll call it a day. Where is that? Sweet. So different merchants have different icons. This place looks like the city of gold or something. You're an outlander, which is good, but a Nora, which might be bad. Do you fear the ruins of the old ones like many in your tribe? No, although some can be dangerous. Then you may have come across what I seek. In your travels, have you found strange vessels emblazoned with symbols of the old ones? They consist Maybe. of a hollow cylinder with a crescent handle affixed at both ends. If you bring me these vessels in sets of four, I will gladly trade what I have for them. What sort of ritual were these vessels made for? 
I'm convinced they were used in conjunction with each other in sets. Some people believe they were used for tea ceremonies. Others think they held sacred essences and oils uh, we'll for worship. I will see if it's tea ceremonies. But I believe they were used for the solemn yeah, custom of shaving Yeah, I was thinking about that too, that they don't beard. have the, um, the things water, on the side. One for water, one for lotion, and so on. Each fluid in its special vessel, majestically applied to the face at each stage of the rite. It must have been breathtaking. But which vessel was used for which? I have to know. I have to continue my research. Important stuff. Are you sure people didn't just drink out of them? Drink? Out of such finely crafted earthenware? Don't be ridiculous. Maybe. <laughs> yes, yes. Trade quickly. I have work to do. I have those ancient vessels already. Cool. I will leave you to the hunt. Be sure to delve into the ruins. Hmm, yes. You look capable. Y Dang, you might really? do. <laughs> Come here, if you will. Let's look at our inventory. Rugged? Well traveled? Yes. I would like to talk to you. Check out these words. Some interesting singing. After the Asaram merchants. I've sent a messenger to the claim to let everyone know. If there's anything you or your clan need for her arrangements, oh, nice paint. you need and masks. Shoes. There'll be time for all of that later. Aloy, I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about Ursa. To learn she lives, then lose that hope seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun tell him what you found in his papers a letter it mentioned a shipment of blaze being sent to a warehouse here only it wasn't addressed to duval the name was 
Eiland Forgeman, does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. It's by the edge of the mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Derval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Aaron, wait. Remember that no one hates Derval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. <clears throat> hard. That'll be hard. Aloy, a moment. Please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? She's not the one who's suffering now. You are. She died before you could say goodbye. Is it that obvious? You're right. I'm dwelling on my pain, not just hers. And there's only one thing left that can help. Find Nerval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. Will do. Let's have a chat. No, a colorful discussion. Let's get confused where it goes. Who are they? Able bodied adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosing. There we go. This is the place. You home, Derval? Looks bored. I got a surprise for you. Oh shit! There's gonna be an explosion. Is it a bomb? Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. It's a bomb, all right. I'll shut up. Well crafted. If I try to take it apart, a booby trap will set it off. That's a lot of blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off, it'll be just what Derval promised. Smoke will darken the sun as the city goes up in flames. There's, there's got to be a way to stop it. That bomb goes. It looks like a wooden bracket. Not very strong. Did I just notice my shoes? Help Those me push cool. this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Yeah, the green fire the stuff into you. True. But when the blaze falls, stuff was brutal, well, man. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is going to get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Nice. Oh, that 
that's big. We did it! Durval's best shot, and Meridian's still standing. This isn't over. Durval said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. And that's too heavily guarded. Uh, this get is a distraction. Let's be sure. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. He tries for the palace. He's finished. Tracks with just a bit of blaze in them. Can I interest you in a reasonable share of a loot? Get to the fire and set up a bucket line. What happened? I haven't heard a blast like that since the liberation. Everyone needs a splash of color in their lives. Come, let's talk it over. Okay, smoke rising them. from the edge of the mesa. A under attack. The tracks lead inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. He tunneled. Durval did find a way into the palace. Dang. Break the bridge, I don't think I can. Let's go. Hitting side, but going up or down. There we go. Weird. I could get it while I can. character. That, um... Peter Dinklage character was really funny. But I really liked Daenerys' story. I read the first book. I was a bit disturbed by how they portrayed, you know, her with Khal Drogo, because in the book he doesn't rape her, but in the show she does. he does. But either way, I liked their their relationship development in the book um and eventually in the show and she just went to become a fucking queen you know i know she did bad stuff towards the end um john snow with his actual real life wife that was beautiful look at you avad the wriggling runt of a maniac king you robbed me of my right to kill your father so i'll have to settle for you I'm going to enjoy watching the car jump. Can see his chest here. Even yeah. more because you'll be watching with me. Let's Say get goodbye him. to Meridian Avad. Breathe in the stench and choke on the ashes. Ah. Something's wrong. 
Nice. They didn't hear the explosion. I also saw Pedro Pascal's I, I uh, didn't hear anything. scene a again in, <laughs> from the mesa's edge. in GOT. No! It's so fucked up. It I love it. It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner. Be hard, I you must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp and disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First yours, then Avad's. Fuck. I'm gonna die so many times, guys. Just be ready. We're under attack. Why does Avad? Whoa, dude, I can't even fucking understand what's going on right now. Keep moving! Can we finish this? I've got a stun gun to kill. I've led an army. Kill. It's not over yet. No. That was it. Any good Osaram Tinker will tell you. That was it. Always have a third plan. Eh? Oh shit! The, the the machines are coming. Oh, the flying ones. Okay. I can do that now. That's sick.
Good hold. What I'm talking about. Ahan and Arya were great together. Really? Joffrey? Dang, dude. I just was like, okay, I need to watch till this fucking guy dies, you know what I mean? His death was very satisfying. As much as I wish Ursa was here to kill you, I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Aaron, you'll screw it up! Bam. Oh, we were gonna keep him alive, I forgot. <laughs> Typical Ilva thing. I know what you are. I really liked, um. Going back Brianna to the of chains. Tar, Every Brianna Tar, Brianna Tar, and uh, the, that Norwegian guy, the Viking looking guy, the ginger, he was awesome. Like so funny. To do your Shut up. You're at the sun Arya was actually my favorite, I'd say. Her development was crazy. And she had so many satisfying goddamn kills, man. Shows that size doesn't matter, you know, if you got fucking, you can change your face and be a badass swords person. <laughs> fair, fair on it. This guy was pretty satisfying to kill. He was really easy to defeat, just two bombs and bam bam, goner. I talk hey, to these wife. people and then, uh, I just think about it, Ursa. Uh, a day, and then I'll be playing GTA in a couple hours, an hour. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place to put him down. But she also told me to grow up. You got to admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do, right? <laughs> You're asking me. I'm pretty sure you're older. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? <laughs> you did with Durval. Yeah. Now, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Chris. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. So, after all this, what's next for Erend Vanguardsman? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get in touch with my clan and we'll lay Has Ursula he even finished properly. the books, man? Like how she would have wanted. I like the first book and, and I, I, I would have continued, but it was like I didn't buy all of them and just drink. had the first one and I haven't gotten around to it. What do you think the Osirim will do to Derval? Trial? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. Hmm. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. Uh, Blood Eagle? Maybe Blood Eagle? That. Just putting it out there. In fact, people. I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. Well... I know. You gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master. All before breakfast. I'm gonna get him throwing a 10 or shard of you know into what? Game of Thrones. He just, met, like, I didn't like it. it was a big shot talking to a pretty he was, girl it was too hyped back in the when middle it, of nowhere. He, cool. he tried watching it. Now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. How could I forget the hairstyle and mustache, bro? Maybe nobody can. Two? two. Huh. She likes me. Oh my god, thanks, Arna. Cool for that. I don't have any more beer. You're awesome, dude. Check how close we are to my goal and I'll finally get a fucking chair. Right now I'm just leaning on the side because it's so fucking uncomfortable. I just need a minute. Dude, Arna, you're the best. Um, as I said, Shara Deva doesn't like when things are like so, like too hype. So he just kind of avoids it, and then I force him into, it and he's like, "Actually, this is really good." But he doesn't want to be like whatever is popular now. He won't watch it. 
He's one of those Aloy, people. To say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You yeah, but you'll like the show, and now that it's died down, I think and we will really you, enjoy it. there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without really you. It was really weird on her. And I don't want to try. But he did, like, respect her more from the start in the books than in the show. I you will staying in Meridian. Isn't it crazy what happened to the, the girl that played Danny? Like, she got two freaking brain clots, brain at things, like, and she survived? That's fucking crazy, man. Were you and Ursa, you know? I suppose it's obvious how I feel, how I felt about her. She didn't just give me advice. She gave me strength. Well, I'm sorry for your but loss, man. we couldn't man. be together. Relations between the Karja and Osaram and Meridian were unsteady as it was. Unrequired love. The union of the Sun King and an Osaram warrior would have led to open revolt in the city. And probably war with the clans. Did anyone know? Only one. Derval. He wanted Ursa, but she rejected him. And so jealousy became yet another of his hateful motivations. Also, Arne, that was what creeped you out, dude. I, I watched the first episode of the show, and then I didn't watch it for a year because I got creeped out by the fucking incest. But that that's what creeped you out, man. <laughs> what exactly will happen to Derval? For now, it's very like that happened so much back in the day when you know the making relations like selling off your kid to like get two kingdoms together and have power that was so common back back not too long ago even my father was very incest is just really fun crazy some Osaron devices surpass even his imaginings what a waste Derval is a brilliant man I wonder what he would have accomplished if it weren't for my father's cruelty. This guy's really thoughtful. I know who attacked the Nora. A faction of Shadow Karja called the Eclipse. They're digging up ancient machines. Weapons they want to use to strike Meridian. I see. What you're saying echoes whispers I've heard from Marad. A Shadow Karja splinter group. Corrupted machines across the land. When will the attack come, do you know? I'm not sure yet. And we will do what we can to prepare. Keep me informed if you learn more. Will do. Oh, we can't talk more? Okay. Nice. Look at how close we are to yet another level. Maybe I can just do something fun. Oh, there we go! I just walked. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, I've been talk telling him that, and you say it on and he listens to you? God damn it, babe. You're really something else. You know that? Whoa, guys. That's crazy. Look at this. It's a floating arrow. I like it. Okay, let's look at our skills. Two skill points. What shall we do? What shall we do? That one's I like that one. This. Why? Do I, can you only have a specific amount of modifications? Is it like full? Ah, true, true, true. It is full. That guy takes a long enough time to write a fucking book. Hey guys, well, um, that's my, uh, Zero Dawn stream. I, I did too- I feel like I did a lot in this, um, this stream. Thanks again for that donation, Arna, you're the best. And, uh, for the chat, guys, it's so awesome chatting with y'all. Sorry if I disappointed you, Ralph, by not just clicking all the dialogue. Well, to be honest, I have a headache today, so I just, like, wanted to get to the action a bit. Um, and I'll probably be more mindful about the dialogue in the future. I just feel like there's a lot of dialogue. 
And I like to listen to about half of it, but uh, if you prefer me to listen to all of it, I can do that. And um, yeah, Sunday, I'm really excited for some Witcher. Um, yeah, this was a this was a fun stream. I feel like we're making a big chunk. I like how there's two different storylines, so I, I got really interested in the end of the world. That's probably what I'm most interested in now, but I do care about, you know, helping these guys out too. Um, so yeah, but I'm excited to play some GTA later today. If you're down to watch me play that, it'll be in about yeah, an hour and 20. And then tomorrow, we're going to try another uh, Der Eisendrache run at uh, about five with our good buddy, Krembini. He, uh, we did all the maps, almost all the maps with him in Black Ops uh, 4. Uh, so it'll be fun to have him join us because he actually, we didn't play Der Eisendrache with him. So I'm excited to see if we can do it like first try. That would be crazy. Probably not, but second or third, maybe. Um, but that'll be fun. And then Sunday we got Witcher and I, I'm going to focus on the main quest there. Maybe do like a couple side quests and then focus on the main quest. We're getting close to the end there. Anyways, remember your Viking loves you and I'll see you guys next Friday for another... Horizon Zero Dawn. Peace.